Hello world! So this is a rainy day in Montenegro. That's <laughs> my dad making fun of me. I'm having a nice breakfast. Actually, I'm having a really nice breakfast. I don't know how that happened. Uh, my father has been cooking breakfast every single morning and making me coffee. So uh, today we are doing something. Um, it's going to be raining. It's, I don't think it's going to be raining too hard because it says like 40-50%, but it's still going to be raining. And unfortunately, where I am right now um, in like this small town, there's really not much to do um, outside of like going to the beach, you know, um, just maybe like sitting in like nice cafes. They have like this coffee culture, you know, like everybody's drinking coffee. So if it's raining, we're probably going to go and um, chill at some cafe. I have a lot of work to do. I have a lot of videos to edit. My dad is writing a book. So like, it's not like we're going to be bored or anything. And honestly, I'm okay with spending one day chill, you know, but we shall see. We also have to do some paperwork because like when you come to Montenegro, you kind of have to um, like register under like a certain address and blah, blah, blah. So we have to do that thing. So we'll see. We'll see. Unfortunately, I won't be able to go to the beach today, but uh, looks like tomorrow might be a beach day. So because everything is super close to each other over here, we just decided to go to Bosnia for lunch, <laughs> which is really cool. Um, it's kind of another, it's going to be the same, honestly. We are going to be on this kind of like more of like a Serbian side of Bosnia, so everyone is going to be Serbian. So it's pretty much going to be like the same as here, but it's just really cool to have like a check, you know, been to another country. <laughs> Let's go to Bosnia. Yeah, this is not the greatest time to drive in the mountains on a slippery road. And the German guy is in front of us and he's so fucking slow. Come on, Germans, let's go. <laughs> Speed it up. I am so fucking scared right now. What the fuck? I am so fucking scared right now. Oh my God, look at this. We're in the mountains. I can't see shit. No, me, the fuck? What? So we decided to wait it out a little bit because it's really scary to jump around the fucking mountains when it's raining like this. We can't see anything. And the, the thing is that like going straight, it's obviously, and I don't drive a car, so like guys, I don't know. But like obviously it's, a, it's very different to just drive straight and doing this fucking one kilometer above the sea level, so. Fuck. I wonder how long we have to be here. Adventure. All right, they let my kind in. Welcome to Bosnia. All right, we are at some sort of a restaurant that appears very strange, but yay Bosnia. All right, so I've arrived to Bosnia. Another restaurant. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna go to like uh, the city city because it's raining really really bad and there's really nothing to I guess see when it rains like this but it's a really cool restaurant it's like very authentic and stuff and over there this is the this is the proof that I went to Bosnia <laughs> it's like a Bosnian um, newspaper but it's really cute it's really cute all the restaurants are kind of like this over here well the rain is not too bad right now so we are taking this opportunity to so uh, to get back home, it's still raining as you can hear and see, but it's not as bad because like going on the roads like this in the mountains when you're like you look down and there's like nothing for miles, that shit was scary. Especially when our car started like swiveling, that was scary. But right now, manageable. Oh, it's a really cool cemetery. Well, you can't really see it, but it's really cool. So we have to drive all of this on the tippity, oh my God, it's raining again. <gasps> Fuck. On the tippity top over there. So that's what I'm talking about. Not a good day to fucking fly around. To lovely Montenegro and save from the hurricane. Woo, that was a fucking trip. I'm injured. I'm injured. <laughs> I actually fell very elegantly. It was like a ballet, passe, move on the floor, some shit. I fell very elegantly. <laughs> Responsible. 
drinking coffee and nothing else. Actually, my dad is doing something. He was actually writing a book. I was doing YouTube. Uploaded two videos. We're literally, I feel like we are in the middle of a fucking apocalypse. I don't even know if we can leave. Like it's really fucking coming down. My knee fucking hurts. I fucked up my fucking knee. Oh God. <laughs> can take me anywhere. Yay, represent! They put Russia next to United States. <laughs> Look at all these cats. What is happening here? <laughs> Hello, lovely humans of YouTube. Um, today is my last day in Montenegro. I'm um, on the beach right now. My plane is at 6.40 p.m. So I am, um, we think we're gonna leave the beach around two to be home at 2.30. And then, you know, shower, blah, 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 this and that. You know, grab something to eat, to, to, take, to, the, to take to the airport. And then I'm off to lovely Istanbul. And then it's gonna be 10 hours layover. Yay. All right, my lovely humans. This is my last day in the lovely country of Montenegro. So right now we're gonna swim. Well, I actually did swim a little. Um, we're gonna finish up tanning and stuff like this. My dad keeps changing his shorts like every 30 minutes. Like every time we swim, he changes. He has multiple items of clothing with him. So we are... What? My dad is judging me and my internet ways. Uh, so we are going to sit here till about one or two. Um, and then... I don't have any brain left to discuss anything, honestly. Like all I've done was like tan and eat and tan and eat. <laughs> I did read a book. I did finish a book. So I did something productive and I did a couple of live streams. So. What? 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 Uh, it's gonna be a long ass fucking day for me because my, my plane is at 6 40 p.m. but I have a 10 hour layover in Istanbul and then I have a plane at 7 a.m. to Moscow which is like excruciating but it is what it is and I'm actually really cool like I always I will tell you guys I'm actually really cool with um, being at airports I actually love it I've never been at the airport for 10 hours that's like a big ass layover but I have videos to edit. I think I'm gonna find a corner and actually make some videos. Uh, I don't think I will be able to do any kind of live stream because like we already tried and unfortunately it's not enough for me to do it. But yeah, life is good. And next up, Moscow. All right, goodbye, beach of Montenegro. Next stop, airport. Well, actually next stop, we need to wash my hair and eat. But overall, yeah. I don't have anything to sell to say. This is a really cool. Dear <laughs> Stone. Oh my god, I have a lot of ideas. I mean, it's nice to work for yourself. It's nice to be like a content, you know, create a streamer, blah blah blah. But it was nice to like get out of New York for just a second and you know get a bunch of ideas and inspiration i watched a bunch of like different streamers and i got a bunch of ideas from them so i'm excited i'm excited and my trip is not even over yet i still have half of it to go and even though i still have 10 hours to spend um at the airport but you guys know me like i'm i'm really chill when it comes to like long layovers long flights I kind of have fun like I always like somehow find things to do so I'm excited let's go it's not a day if I do, if we don't stop in some sort of authentic restaurant of Montenegro last lunch in Montenegro difficult difficult life in Montenegro you eat and then you go up some fucking mountain God, and my dad is fucking sprinting all the time swear to god goodbye goodbye lovely montenegro well this is like a horrible view <laughs> it's much prettier guys last uh goodbye on a terrace slash balcony goodbye world i will see you next year don't miss me too much i understand that 
the entire country is mourning my okay uh, хорошо I said the entire country is mourning my departure don't mourn too much tomorrow is actually bad weather so I'm leaving oh my god okay bye bye world all right this is the last car ride before my next stop <laughs> my father is a man of a few words <laughs> I got my new headphones I got my favorite shirt uh, there are like cars from all over Europe I like my, my father said that I have way too much makeup on I think it's just right goodbye lo lovely Montenegro yay rich people race <laughs> Our car is is on the big boat next to but is it crazy? That's awesome. So we're gonna we park the car on the boat and now we're gonna go. Just the way we came here, we are leaving. Well I'm leaving. My dad still has like eight days here. Yay, we are moving. It's really cool to have like cars with us on the boat. It's really cool. All right, everyone, so this is the last day in Montenegro. There are a shit ton of people over here. Yo, I feel like everyone is going on the same flight because like every single, I don't know, thingy is for the same destination. So the flight is only about like hour and maybe like 40 minutes. So yeah, and then I have 10 hours. And... There is so much problem here. I'm not even gonna, you know, point anything, but there's so much problem out here. Everybody's screaming, everybody's yelling. It's so exciting. This is my best flight ever. All right, loves of my life. We are in lovely Tiva Airport. I cannot even fucking begin to explain to everyone how it fucking was. Like, it's a tiny fucking airport, a fucking shed, and like, it took forever, forever to go through um, like a passport border control. And the thing is, like, I'm not saying like JFK is super efficient, but like JFK is a major airport with like shit ton of planes going back and forth. So is Istanbul. But over here, no kidding, we were here for like an hour and a half and the plane is like maybe fucking, I don't even know, like 70, like there was like no people. They took their sweet fucking time, there was a fight, there was police involved, so it was very entertaining. But um, I am here, I managed to get two carry-ons with me, because technically you're allowed one personal item, one carry-on. So this is my personal item. But my personal item weighs like more than my carry-on because all of my equipment is in my backpack. So thank God they didn't weigh it. But I guess they were like so tired from everything. But let me let me show you like the airport a little bit. This is it. Took forever. Took forever. <laughs> Alright, loves of my life. This is the coolest shit ever. I'm gonna tell everyone that this is my private motherfucking plane. And welcome to Anastasia Airlines, Luna Airlines. <laughs> uh, I had some beer, so it's gonna be fun today. All right, hello world. We are finally uh, approaching the last leg of our tour. I think my makeup looks good. My dad told me that I'm wearing too much makeup. I think it's fine. Um, so we are leaving um, Montenegro and going to Istanbul. And again, I'm gonna have a 10 hour layover, but a lot of good things happened because we actually like got because there was like a bunch of like kind of like little tiny problems on the board not even problems just like people like started fighting and everything so uh people with a brain which i hope includes me we formed like our own uh little group so we're like traveling together we had a glass of wine together and uh because i have 10 hour layer i was like i don't mind being alone ever but um it's still 10 hours by myself during the night which is very different from like uh being at the airport during the day in a different country because you can always go outside and do like whatever you want but i made friends with a lot of people so we're gonna have like our little group and um we are just gonna you know have fun in the istanbul airport during the night so 
let's go next stop moscow i officially not going to the hotel because all of this is mine and i'm gonna be sleeping forever living my best life living my best life good night